Cities are the key to the growth of regions and indeed to the growth of countries. Dublin is central to the growth of Ireland. We need young, articulate and able representatives. Mary Fitzpatrick is a dynamic city councillor who I think would make an excellent choice for Dublin. I've been elected to represent the people of Dublin on City Council now for 10 years. For the last five years, I've been leader of the Fianna Fáil group on the City Council. We're a very small group. There's only six Fianna Fáil members out of 52. We've been in opposition for the last 10 years, but even in opposition, I've been highly effective. I've been highly determined in championing issues that are affecting my constituents and the people of Dublin's lives on a daily basis. We will represent 500 million people in the next European Parliament, and I want to be a strong voice and a strong champion for Dublin. I'm dealing with people every day and the biggest issue, I suppose, of concern to people is employment, securing employment or sustaining employment. To start with, the European Parliament is the only directly elected institution of the European Union and there will be 751 MEPs representing the population of Europe. We need an MEP from Dublin who will be able to not only advocate for Dublin from an informed position, knowing the challenges that people are facing in their daily lives in Dublin, but somebody who will be able to champion Dublin in the next European Parliament and drive policies and decisions out of Europe that can support employment creation and support small businesses to continue to grow in Dublin. 80% of our laws are coming out of Europe. Our budgets are now approved in Europe. Europe has more relevance as the days go on and the MEPs that we send to the European Parliament have significant powers in terms of both approving and rejecting laws or approving policies or approving budgets. And it's really critical that we have MEPs who are not going to Europe just to continue to shore up the government party line, but MEPs who actually understand the issues on the ground in Dublin, who can actually champion the causes that need to be championed for the people of Dublin, and MEPs who will be there in the centre of the Parliament, not to the extreme left or to the extreme right, but as I would be as a Fianna Fáil MEP, as part of the group of Liberals in Europe, who can hold that balance of power and who can try to, through building alliances and through our grouping in the Liberal uh, grouping, uh, redirect the focus of the European Parliament and redirect the priority of the European Union away from the agenda of austerity, which we've had for the last number of years, and focusing the agenda on growth, employment and recovery. Mary knows the needs of Dublin through her experience on the City Council uh, for, for many years. Um, she has a great sense of what the capital requires and would be a great advocate for the people of Dublin at European parliamentary level.